Hi guys, in previous videos I've shown you this individual devices. Today I'm going to show you something interesting. So this is our rack guys. So all the devices are interconnected to each other. So this is how they are arranged in real time also. So in the top two you can see these are two ASA firewalls, Cisco's ASA firewall. And here we have multiple switches. So, so I have one, two, three, four switches and one, two, three, four routers. So they are all interconnected to this particular terminal server. So through this terminal server, I, I can get the access of all the devices. So how can I get the access? So three ways you can be able to get the access. The first one is physically. So I can get a console cable. I can connect it to this terminal server and to my local computer and I get the access. The second one is through Wi-Fi. So this terminal server is connected to Wi-Fi and my remote PC is connected to that particular Wi-Fi. So within the range will be sitting and I'll be able to get the access. And third way is through RDP. So through RDP, it doesn't matter you have to be in Bangalore. It can be anywhere in the world and still you will be get, able to get the access. So we have a link and port number assigned to this particular um, terminal server. And through the user credentials in the link, you will be able to get the access. So our international students, those who are away from Bangalore, still they will be getting all the access of this particular rack, though they are not physically present. Okay. So these are the three ways you will be able to get the access. Okay. Thank you.